Hello folks, food animal agriculture is making great strides towards improving our environment while continuing to find ways to produce food more bountifully and economically. I will share with you one example of a seemingly insignificant tool that is making a significant positive difference for producers, consumers, and the earth as it capitalizes on one of the cow's unique God-given attributes. But first, here's a free lesson on this unique feature, the cow's digestive system. Like other ruminants, sheep, goats, bison, and deer, cows have four compartments to their stomach. The first of these compartments, the rumen, operates like a huge fermentation vat. After cows scarf up grass, hay, and other forages, they lay down for some R&R, rest and rumination. They cough up forages in small quantities called the could and rechew and swallow it with pH buffered saliva. Thus the phrase, chewing her could. To simple stomach creatures such as dogs, cats, pigs, and humans, this saliva forage blend is indigestible. But when a cow swallows could, Millions of protozoa and bacteria, bugs if you will, which reside in her rumen break down the cellulose and other fibrous plant sources. They convert it to energy for the cow. Some, however, escapes into the atmosphere as methane when the cow burps. In the process, protein in the forages is degraded to the basic protein building block, nitrogen. This nitrogen exists in a gaseous state ammonia. Most of the ammonia is captured by the rumen bugs and converted into amino acids for use by the cow. As long ago as the 1930s, environmentalists have been concerned about this bovine generated gas contributing to a depletion of the ozone layer. Recent scientific studies have demonstrated that this is not as major a concern as once believed. In fact, this natural process results in a win-win situation. Cows consume what, for most animals, are indigestible yet renewable plant resources. 45% of this great country is grassland, unusable as food to humans. Cows convert these forages into protein and energy, providing milk and meat for all of us. Truly sustainable and renewable food production and at a positive contribution to our environment. Now, about this new tool. I mentioned at the beginning, Monensin, a new technology widely adapted in recent years by cattlemen and dairymen, is a feed additive that stimulates the tiny little rumen bugs I described earlier to work even more efficiently. When Monensin is included in a cow's diet, the rumen bugs work with greater efficiency to capture significantly more carbon-containing methane reducing most of all the methane that might escape into the environment. What's more, cattle-fed monensin actually perform more efficiently on about 10% less feed. In dairy cows, this means more milk produced on less feed with no extra effort by the cow. Think about it. A few pennies worth of monensin fed daily to each cow increases productivity 10 to 15% and minimizes methane eruptions from cows. It's great for the environment and sustainable agriculture and more profitable for cattle and dairy producers. Is that a deal or what? Well, that's it for today, folks. I'm Doc Sanders, and I'll see you down the road. Down the Road is brought to you in part by Prince Agra, makers of Omnigen AF, advancing animal nutrition for healthy animals, and Woodruff Enterprise of Springfield, Ohio, 